Do you want to do uh, something about pineapple weed? Yeah, they're fun. They always, <laughs> it makes me smile right away. It's one of those, uh, one of those kind of plants. Let me just say that the Latin name for this is Matricaria matricarioides, and that to a botanist means something because that's the same genus as German chamomile, and uh, most of the other chamomiles are are matricarias also. So they are. This is really an American wild chamomile. I like how it smells. Um, so uh, you know, when you s squeeze its little head, it gives off that. Um, that uh, nice little fragrance. It smells uh, very perfumey almost. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like a, I can smell it even through my buckskin here. <laughs> um, but they call it pineapple weed because it does have a little smell like a pineapple, you know, when you, a fresh pineapple when you first yeah. open it. Okay. And its little head is, is kind of shaped like a pineapple too. It's a uh, Do you do it, use it medicinally for anything? Yeah, you could eat it because it's wild chamomile, and chamomile is used for a sedative, you know, to help you relax. You can make tea out of it, and you could, um, you, you know, it's it's an edible little guy. What John has in his hand is um, a contemporary form of of uh, how I use it also. These grow where um, where there's a lot of heavy traffic. Back home, that means that it's not a healthy growing area. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. that means that there's a lot of cars that have passed over it, or you know, it's on a you know on a trail that's been um, overpopulated. Mm -hmm. And so, I have a hard time finding a healthy growing area for my pineapple weed. So when I do come across it, I harvest it and I treasure it. And I preserve it in in this way. Um, I make a, a oil with it for one way because it's uh, like an anti-inflammatory too. It helps to relax the area that you injured. If you're thinking about it in the same way as how if you drink it as a tea, you know, it's work on that physical side as well. I have it in a roll-on bottle and just roll it on my. I sprained my ankle really bad. I had an old injury um, from a long time ago. Can you smell it? Oh yeah, it smells good. Yeah, it, it's it's strong. Mm. And I was wearing my boot, and my I turned my ankle, and when I got home, I took off my boot, and it just blew up. It just went whoosh, and it turned black all the way up to here. And I, I laid down and I elevated my foot and I told my son to, to get my oil and put it on there and it took care of me, fixed me up pretty fast. Mm -hmm. And I mix it with Arnica for if I have pain like that. And um, So there's Arnica in here? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's a good combination. Mm -hmm. I use it the same way. Mm -hmm. Put it on wounds that uh, you want to heal faster and mm -hmm. soothing, anti-inflammatory. And uh, a few weeks ago, I got a call from a woman who had a hobo spider bite. Mm. And of course, gumweed is good for spider bites, but um, after the gumweed, there was still something left in there, some of the venom. Mm. And she needed further treatment to take down the swelling. So pineapple weed is what I used for that. And I have also used it when... Um, Injuries have splinters or bone fragments below the surface to draw those up to, through pustules. And it's amazing how fast it'll draw up foreign particles and they'll come up to the surface. Have you used it for that also? Um, yeah, for uh, bone injury. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, so. I yeah, know. So that's uh, good. Oh, go ahead. No, I was just saying it's really good. I, I like the little <laughs> plant. I always get excited. Ah, oh, pineapple <laughs> weed! And I get all excited. Oh, I like it as tea just because it's fun to drink in the yeah. wintertime when you dry those mm -hmm. and put them in tea. They're just like chamomile. Yeah, it's good stuff. I talked to a, a German plant collector who was collecting during World War II in Germany for his dad, who was a civilian pharmacist. And they used pineapple weed for bullet wounds and um, bone fragments. Mm -hmm. To, to get them up to the surface when all of the synthetic drugs went to the military. Right. So it's, 
uh, that was not pineapple weed, but German chamomile, which has the same chemical constituents, so it works the same way. Yeah, and they could get um, decent size. They get in some areas, they get pretty big. The heads get pretty big. Yeah, they do, and uh, they get pretty big here. But we're past the prime growing season, and this is one that sprouted up late. 